Hey there, so in this video, I'm going to demonstrate you a login form inside a bootstrap model and that too using Laravel Livewire. So sometimes in your application, you may want user to log in using a model instead of directly going to the login page. And the reason might be you don't want the user to leave that page. So for example, if I'm on this page and there is an action which user needs to perform and he needs to be logged in into the application to perform that. So let's say this is the action user clicks on that and in order to perform that action user should be logged in so this is the model window that i have created it has the laravel authentication so if you fill in the blank fields it will give you the validation messages and if you give in a username and password which is not in the database and you try to log in you get back with a error message that the credentials do not match our records and if you try to log in with a valid username and password and hit login you are now logged in the page is refreshed and you can now access the account and all the details as a logged in user so this is all done using livewire and uh, i'll show you how this is built using laravel livewire so I have used the bootstrap 5 model and inside that I have uh, two fields username and password. When user clicks on the login button basically it calls the login function which validates if you have provided the correct username and password uh, if you provide the valid username and password and then we use the attempt login function which is basically attempt function from the auth guard to check if the user is user has has provided the correct credentials if yes we put that in the session and redirect the user to the current page if not we send the user we just send back the error message on that model itself pretty simple and this is done using liveware and on the front end we are showing error message just below the input field if user has not provided the correct login information and if you are already logged in and you try to perform the same action again we are just showing you are already logged into the application user has an option to log out the component is reusable and you can use that in your application it is available at this url and i'll paste the url in the description below I hope you liked it. Thank you.